Hi, I'm Shiv Ghani. Thanks for checking out the Raised Line interview series in which me and my co-hosts, Dr. Rishi Desai and registered nurse Jana Amil, explore how to strengthen our healthcare system with some amazing leaders in medicine, technology, education, and government. And they have some great advice for people starting careers in healthcare as well. I hope you will watch these highlights and then go listen to the full podcast interview wherever you get your podcasts. Hi, I'm Shiv Ghani, and today on Raised Line, I'm really happy to be joined by Laura Turner. Laura is currently the executive director of the Health Professional Student Association, which is an organization dedicated to improving the availability of healthcare resources in underserved communities in the United States. So, yeah, with that, I'd love to hear more about your background. Um, you know, obviously, you've, you've been uh, at the head of SDN for some years, uh, but for our audience, uh, this is probably the first time they're meeting the, the person who runs SDN. So uh, would love to hear more about uh, what got you into this uh, career. Sure, sure. So my background is in software development. I worked almost all my career in various companies at uh, doing different software development tasks, uh, not really from the programming side of things, but really more of the product management, project management side, trying to come up with solutions for problems using systems or software. So I've worked at a financial services company and I worked at a ticketing company number of different places. And then I had the opportunity uh, about 10 years ago to join Student Doctor Network and try and work on some of the systems and come up with solutions to help folks who were in their processes of trying to apply to health professional schools. So medical school, dental school, veterinary school, uh, optometry school, all those different areas. Uh, but what is your uh, advice to our listeners about meeting the challenges of COVID and beyond? I would say that students should try and retain the flexibility they've had to, to have to be successful during these times of COVID and keep that with them as they move forward. The future is not going to stop having changes and challenges and things rolling at you. But And the more you can kind of roll with the changes and be flexible, the more successful you're going to be in your medical career, your healthcare career. Thanks for watching this preview of Raised Line. To hear the full interview, check out all of our podcasts and subscribe to the series. Please go to osmosis.org forward slash Raised Line podcast or listen wherever you get your podcasts.